If you've been posting on Facebook for your business and you're finding that you're getting people that are literally just hijacking your posts and they're posting spammy comments where they're promoting links and recommending that you contact people and then thank them later. You know, I get this all the time. I get, you know, two, two to five, sometimes 10 of these kind of spammy comments on my bigger posts that are doing well. And it can be incredibly time consuming having to go through every single comment and hide them or delete them. So, you know, wouldn't it be great if you could actually um, do this automatically? Well, the great news is you can, and there's a native feature to Facebook that you can set up. It's called Moderation Assist, and it will basically hide these comments before they even get published. So nobody's going to see all this negative, spammy, promotional uh, content that are underneath your posts. So in this short video, I'm going to show you how to set it up so it doesn't need to take your precious time to get rid of these spammy comments, and it will happen automatically. So let's dive on over to my screen, and I'll show you how it works. Okay, so we are over on on my Facebook profile at the moment. And the first thing to note is that you do need to have a professional profile to activate this feature. If you don't have a professional profile yet, I recommend that you update your uh, standard profile to professional, do a search of YouTube or Google to see how to do that. And I'll be creating a video on that very soon as well. But if you do have a professional profile, then make sure you're over on your home page. And please remember that Facebook does like to move these features and buttons around. So it might be in a slightly different place. And then come on over to your professional dashboard, which you're gonna see over on the left-hand side somewhere in this menu and click on that. And now once you're in your professional dashboard, if you just look down until you find moderation assist and click on that, and then this comes up with the moderation assist menu. I've got this set up already right here, so I can add or edit a criteria. I've currently got four criteria set up. So if any one of these criteria are met, the comments will be auto hidden. Let me just show you what these comments actually look like. So this is my activity log for moderation assist. And you can see here, there's one here. Get in touch with Mr. Anthony Jackson. You'll be sure to thank me later. Bob Clark, get in touch with. So basically people are hijacking my post and replying to other people who have left comments. Um, and and they're, they're pretty similar. But I, you know, I looked at this and I think there was hundreds of these comments that have happened recently. If I had to do this manually, it would take me ages to actually delete and remove them. So by us setting up moderation assist, it's gonna really help with this. So what you wanna do is come to the bit where it says uh, here, where you can add and click on add. And then you're gonna be able to add certain criteria. So if the person who's leaving a comment here has a new account, then it's gonna automatically hide their comments because nobody really has new accounts these days unless they're spammers. Um, if there's no profile picture, it's gonna automatically hide their comment. So most people have got a profile picture. Again, spammers generally don't. Sometimes they do, but this is just one of the ways. If they've got no friends or followers, well, I'm actually gonna turn this one on as well. And I'm gonna add that. So if they haven't got any friends or any followers, you know, why are they on Facebook anyway? Well, probably to be spammy. So I'm also gonna add the next, are they a repeat offender? Let's have a look at this one. Author has had at least three comments reported, deleted or hidden by admins in the last 30 days. Well, I'm gonna add that as well. Okay, this is an important one. Comment has certain keywords. So I would add this one in as well. I've already got it added, but I'll just show you what I've added here. So you can add in your keywords. I've got thank me later. So in order to do this, let's just do this. So I'm just gonna go thank me later and then just type a comma. And then the other one that I've noticed that happens quite frequently is professional hacker. And I'm just gonna put that as well. And then that automatically adds for you. And you can add a few of these. Just be a little bit careful with this one because if a normal person uses these words, it's also gonna get hidden as well. But generally nobody does unless they're a hacker. So we will save that. The other one I've added is comment has a link. So if somebody leaves a link under my post in the comments, this is gonna auto hide the comment. Not many people do unless they're trying to promote something or spam under your profile. So I would add that one. Author does not have a profile pic. Well, we've done that one. Author has had their Facebook account for one week or less. We've done that. So let's just have a look at the other options that they've got here. 
Um, if there's an image in the comment, if there's profanity in the comments, if there's links to specific sites, or if there's a video in the comments. I'm not gonna worry about that for now because I haven't really noticed this happen yet. It might happen and then at some point, you know, there might be images in my comments and I say, oh, I don't want those anymore. I wanna hide them. So I'll literally just click on that and add this to, auto, uh, to moderation assist. And then, you know, if somebody swears a lot and, you know, in, in the comments and my children happen to see it, obviously I'm gonna wanna start hiding that as well. But this is all I need right now. So new account, no profile picture, no friends or followers, repeat offender, if there's a link in the comments and if there's certain keywords in the comments. Again, be, be a little bit careful with the keywords in the comments. Uh, I, as I said, thank me later and professional hackers seems to be the ones that they use the most um, and get this set up. And then what you'll notice is instead of you actually having to hide or delete these comments yourself underneath your posts, they will automatically hide. So as soon as somebody comes over and hijacks your post, Facebook just you know, they'll recognize the, 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 that the moderation assists on and they'll just get rid of or hide that. And it, what it means is that nobody else will be able to actually see those comments. And then one thing you can do if you come on over to your post on Facebook and go to, to the actual post, you can click on view more comments. So let's just say you've posted something and you wanna double check, has anybody's uh, comment been hidden by accident? So what you can do here is you can search by most relevant or you can search by hidden by you or all comments. So if I look at this one here and go all comments, I can see right here that actually there is no comments that have been hidden. But if I go to hidden by you, we will see here that there's, yeah, there's a couple here that have automatically been hidden as well. Um, and you know, this person here messaged me, the professional hacker, Facebook's automatically hidden it. So you can double check if you want to. To be honest, I don't bother. Most people's comments go through without any issues, but hopefully this will help you um, save a lot of time ultimately on having to do this manually yourself. So get Moderation Assist set up. And uh, if you've got any questions about this, if you're not sure how to find the feature, uh, just let me know underneath this video and I'll be sure to help you as quickly as possible. If you'd like more trainings like this and you wanna see more of my free videos, make sure you hit that like button and follow and subscribe for more. And I will see you in the next video soon. Gavin Mountford here, bye for now.